It's the morning of the first day of the month. Power BI has crunched my Sage 50 sales data overnight and I'm looking at last month's sales figures by sales rep. And the first thing I notice is that we have a problem with Michelle. She's highlighted in red, which means her percentage margin last month was low. Now that's not like her. She normally delivers good margin sales. Now taking a look at the company as a whole, I can quickly see that for January and February, sales are up against last year. Their margins are down and I'm a bit worried about the margin trend from January to February. Could this be down to Michelle's poor margin performance last month? It could well be, so let's take a look. What were her customer sales last month? Ah, this looks like the problem. We have a big credit, probably a product return, to one of her customers, Advanced Care RX Pharmacy. So what's the story with this customer? Okay, I see, there was a big credit against one product. It looks like a product problem rather than a Michelle problem or a customer problem. So if we look at sales last month of this product, we see that there were credits issued to a number of customers, affecting five of the sales reps. But the impact on Michelle and her customer advanced care was by far the greatest. So this was clearly an exception for February sales figures and not really representing an underlying trend. So how would February have looked if we excluded this product? Well, let's take a look at the sales summary year to date and I will add a filter to exclude that product. Now, do you remember that I was worried about the margin trending down? Well, this is reversed, suggesting that the underlying trend is actually okay. And we can see that year to date, Michelle has in fact made a higher margin contribution than anybody by a long way. So to conclude, February's numbers actually look okay. There's nothing up with Michelle and there's clearly a product issue and the purchasing department can deal with that. So it's time now to start looking at how we can steal a march on March. Do you want to look at your Sage 50 data for last month through Power BI? Well, you can. Why not give it a try?